Germany is out. And you? Hello, welcome to this video episode about how to reach higher performance levels. My name is Volkmar Fölzke and what am I talking about here? Germany is out. Depending on where you are, if you are interested in soccer and the football or soccer world cup that recently took place, and maybe you followed it. Uh, what was quite um, a big headline was in terms of that the German team, which is always a strong one, was kicked out in the first round. And it's very, um, um, very surprising to many. And there was some really some, some nasty comments about this, why these arrogant Germans and it's great that they're kicked out, etc. But uh, careful always if you point to others that uh, when you point with one finger to others, three fingers are pointing back to yourself, right? Maybe you know this. And that's here the same. My point is Germany is out and you can, uh, if you are not interested in soccer, just take any other example, any sports that this team that was one of the favorites, one of the, the winning candidates uh, was kicked out very early in the tournament. And this is exactly the case here. So um, I have three ideas to think about what it means to your business, because it's basically the same thing in a business team. Sometimes we are kicked out of whatever, of business success of our year that we planned so much and then now we don't make the numbers. And why is this? And I give you three ideas and that might happen as well to your team. Potentially, we have the risk in any team that these things are happening. And uh, yeah, just some food for thoughts as always. Number one, a mental work. Mental work. So the thing is, it's so obvious. If a team goes on the, on the, on the green or let's say in the office in your case or at the customer, we need always to get in that we say, okay, we want, we are going in to win. It's such a low brainer, but we tend to forget that over and over again. And that is one part that happened to the German team. I think, I'm sure, somewhere deep inside, they were not really hungry for winning because it was for them obvious that we anyway will at least go to the semi-final or something like that, even maybe win the World Cup. So the first games were very much a low brainer for them and we don't put any much effort in. And that's exactly the mistake. We sometimes tend to st keep thing take things easy in our mind that are not easy. We should always work for that and strive to win. <coughs> That's number one. So the mental work. Number two, the development work. I think it was at the German team as well that because they won the last World Cup that they were very much in the state of, yeah, okay, now we have a great team. We have just whatever changed some positions, but basically we win also the next one because we have still the potential and we have the potential. I mean, the thing is um, we need still, even if we are, and especially if we are in a good uh, number one position, then in particular, we need to invest in, in developing ourselves more. I make this point also repeatedly in all my, my writings and my videos. Um, it's some people, uh, when we have a boom time in, in, in the economy, for example, that they think, okay, let's just get out and sell and deliver, etc., and do not invest now in our people. And that's exactly the wrong thing, especially when things go well, we should invest, we should really put in our effort into our development, even if it's hard, even if we don't find the time, sort of, we have to. We have to, because that is a time when we need to invest and that was the same for the German team, maybe for your team. Look at it, if you think you are so great, now is the time to develop more. And number three, rework. So what I mean by this is, um, uh, that every victory is a bit connected to the first point must be won new. So we need to rework each game. We cannot just go on there and say, okay, we win it anyway. So it's first in our mindset and then we need to rework each game is a new game. It's starts with zero. Yeah. So, so it's, it's the same if you have a new customer or something or like a new bid or a new proposal or something, whatever it is, or a new product, a new innovation, it starts with zero. You have to restart again. You rework the whole thing. And this we also sometimes tend to forget. We think it's all home runs just by default and we do one and the next. Sometimes that happens, but that's just by good luck. It's just by because we are creating this and we are just in this momentum. That's great. But our mindset, our, our work, our focus should always be we start from zero again. Let's do it again. And this is hard. This is very hard in the mind. And you see what it leads to if we don't do it properly we get out in the first round. So I hope that doesn't happen to your business and your team. I hope that gives you some food for thoughts if you are in soccer or not, doesn't matter for this. And yeah, maybe you become a little bit better by this every week when you watch these videos. I am looking forward to seeing you in the next one. And until then, each day, go out and drive your success with passion.